Steve came to us for some bad neck pain. He suffered multiple head injuries and now plays video games all the time. Watched our video on Video Game Body here and said, I got to come to this guy. Sleeps at night on pillows that are too big and hurts his neck. It hurts when he leans back here and also hurts right there on his neck. You can see that. He had injections out of the chiropractor office. Travesty. Uh, they have medical doctors there. Never go to a freaking chiropractor that has medical doctors. Let's treat them now. Interesting about him is that he leads with his head when he does things. And so when he was a kid, he uh, hit his head on bricks. I mean, like, yeah. you know, and then and then 2007, he was on the bed and he flipped off the bed by bouncing off the bed like a trampoline kind of thing and then landed on his freaking head again. And then in 2016, playing football, you know, his D1 scholarship was, <laughs> was <laughs> revoked. <laughs> revoked because some guy upended him and hit his on his freaking head. And so, you know, some people are smart. He's not very smart because he keeps yeah, leaving exactly. his head. And so uh, if you guys learn anything, don't lead with your head. Pain comes from my neck, like in the midsection. So whenever I'm, mostly when I'm looking back or when I play video games, it hurts a lot or to sleep. But you got a video game body. Yeah, exactly. Just I seen that video. <laughs> um, so when I go when I go to sleep, I like an elevated pillow. But when I put my head down, it hurts. So the only way I have to do it is on like straight on my back. So he went to the chiropractor and sprained his neck, and obviously that was bullshit because he went there for an entire year. Yeah. And he was pretty consistent. And uh, he not only did this, got adjusted, right? Yeah. But they uh, talked him into these uh, ridiculous uh, um, injections, five injections total, yeah. right? Yeah. And so, you know, some of these, if you go to a chiropractor's office and they have medical doctors working for him, run! <laughs> because they don't know what the fuck they're doing. Um, whenever I eat, I'm not even full, but I'll probably be a couple, like, spoonfuls in and I feel like I'm already full and I need, like, the need to throw up. Oh, Every I night, saying. I probably wake up at least two, three times a night and it's kind of like, at the same time, always like around three o'clock and then like four o'clock, I wake up, toss and turn for a couple minutes, and then I just go back to sleep. Yeah. Do you wake up tired all the time too? Is no. Yeah. Every time. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I, I haven't felt a good night's rest and that's since I can remember really. Just please. How much pain you back there, sir? Um, not much. Not much. Okay. Well, go ahead and put your hands on your back. Lean back, please. How much pain there? Like five or six. Five or six. And then his pain's in his back. And go ahead and do it again. I want to show everybody how flexible you are. He's pretty freaking flexible. Yeah. And so, again, you you dummies out there that think that flexibility is going to help you, it doesn't. If he if flexibility was the key or physicality was the key or his age or his weight, he would not be in my office. Look at this guy. He looks pretty freaking healthy to me. Can you look at the footer, please? Nothing. Yeah, like when, I, when I go back, that's where it hurts the most. And how much pain? Probably like a seven. Like seven? Yeah, and that one's constant throughout that's constant. the day. Yeah. Gotcha. Uh, he has knee pain, but it doesn't come up right now. We checked it a second ago, but we're going to check his dermatomes. He has an L4 dermatome. So tell me what the difference is here. Uh, I get more feeling in my right leg. So left leg yeah. is number. The x rays. Uh, <clears throat> uh, pretty obvious. Uh, high reverse curve. Definitely off balance. Um, definitely some tension in his back. Some mild scoliosis in his back. Um, but again, the reverse curve is a high reverse curve, which I told you always is the worst one. The lower reverse curve is not as bad, but uh, they're still all bad. But his is high, uh, osteophyte the back of the head, pushing the atlas way inverted. So it's uh, all that stuff is on the x-rays. Check out those arrows. You can see Steve's imbalance on his x-rays. Eight millimeter right imbalance, eight degree spinal scoliosis. Here we have nine millimeter right short leg, eight degree spinal curve. Here we have atlas occipital compression, really bad. High neck reversal, also bad. And the last one, slight sway back, not so bad. Damn, this one here. Good. Wow. He's went tight punk. So, uh, how'd that feel, sir? Uh, feels good. I'm a little blurry right now, but like. A little blurry? Yeah. So you felt, felt something instantaneous? You know, yeah, for sure. My ears bit. getting hot. Yeah, I felt that. Yeah, yeah. How is that different than the other chiropractors? Uh, the other one, I feel like it's just my bones cracking, mm -hmm. but this one, like, is like a specific targeted area, and I felt like, I don't know if it's nerves, I don't know the science behind it. You felt something change. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. This side is really flexible, and you can tell he self-adjusts all the time. You can hear him popping. Good, wow. And so, um, that was a little more difficult. Uh, the angle of his neck is a little harder to get in the left side, so I had to take more slack out of it. I might have to do even more next time. As always, helping the patient up, Steve, and reminding him not to twist and turn or he'll undo my work.
Weren't you uh, the dummy that looked at my videos first and still went to the other place first? Yeah, exactly. Why'd you do that? I'm kind of curious. <laughs> uh, I was trying to go the economical route. Yeah. I, I didn't think my case would be that bad. Of the, that <laughs> and it being more expensive. Exactly. That's yeah. the funny part. Yeah. So cheap becomes expensive. Yeah. You're going to learn this all your life, boys. Pay what you get for, for sure. Yeah. Prime example. Yeah, exactly. It is time to send Steve down the hall to recalibrate. Arms at your side, look straight ahead. I feel like lighter or like clear headed. I don't know if that's a word, but like. I almost feel like I had to recalibrate how I walked. Like it was, it was different, like a different feeling. Your whole body felt yeah, different. Right? Yeah, it wasn't yeah. just your head. Yeah, and I still kind of feel like a little off, huh? Yeah, like you're a little still a little lightheaded. Yeah, a little yeah, bit. yeah. Trust, please. Good. You had no pain there. No. Let's go back. Let's check this stuff out. That was a six. <laughs> yeah, there's nothing there. Yeah, I don't feel anything there yeah, anymore. Yeah. So, yeah, there's nothing. <laughs> <Good. laughs> People always like to see people's their face and facial expressions yeah. after you know that's the funny yeah. thing. But you're, I can't pay him yeah. to fake that smile. Like oh. no. <laughs> you know, it doesn't happen. <laughs> you look like a dumbass. Just it comes naturally okay. out of you when you feel something different, right? Yeah. So that's anyways. Sure. That's the truth. So go ahead and look down, please. That was really. That was like maybe yeah, one yeah, or two. That's yeah, different. That's the ceiling. That was a painful one, dude. Right? Yeah. That one is like a. Two or three now, it's for sure better. For like sure it's better? Yeah, it doesn't bother me. You're not just saying it because you want to be YouTube famous, right? No, no, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not good with cameras, so. <laughs> and you're doing good right now, sir. <laughs> and so, uh, is this different than the year you spent over there? No, yeah, for sure. Because like I said, like when I was going over there, I felt like it was just my bones cracking, kind of like what I was doing to myself. I mean, it felt good for the first couple minutes. As soon as I walked out that door, it was, yeah, 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 it was yeah, still yeah. there. So yeah. now I feel actual relief. Good, perfect. Uh, so again, good chiropractic, bad chiropractic. <laughs> That's the difference. See you guys next time. One month later, where, how are you feeling, dude? Uh, I'm feeling a lot better now. Not a, the pain, not as constant anymore. Um, with like the adjustments of like fixing my posture and stuff, it helps ease the pain whenever I do feel pain. Gotcha. Uh, I feel like it's actual improvement versus mm -hmm. like before it was like Mickey Mouse. You know what I mean? It was temporary. Mm. temporary I didn't give the word Mickey Mouse by the way. <laughs> temporary <laughs> relief. So we have neck pain. That's doing better, right? Yeah. Um, low back pain. How's that? Yeah, there's none basically. And then nausea with eating? No, I, I'm able to. So when I'm eating, um, I don't know in terms of my portions if I'm eating more portions, but. Before, when I was getting full, I'd get like nauseous and stuff. So I'd kind of like, it would, in a sense, almost ruin my meal. Uh -huh. uh, but now I'm able to get full and like be satisfied and not yeah. be nauseous. Sleep, anxiety. Let's do that too. Um, yeah, I've been sleeping a lot better. Um, before, I was waking up a few times a night um, just for whatever reason. Yeah, the girls, by the way. <laughs> tossing and turning. <laughs> but um, Either I'm not waking up in the middle of the night anymore, or it's way. That's probably one time for gotcha. just like the. And how, how well do you feel rested in the morning? I feel um, a little more energetic in the energetic. morning, like gotcha. ready to start my morning. Love it's it. easier to get out of bed. You just been cracking my neck. That's, that's it. it, right? Yeah, that's it. So you come, you drive all this way, you pay me all this money just to crack your neck. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. That's it. And just to do it. Just to do that. So I would probably say eighty percent of it. Interesting. To be honest, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, the easy part is just coming in here and getting adjusted, but. The conscious effort comes from fixing your, your posture and your form and writing all your notes down. Wow. I think that uh, was a home run for today. So thanks for watching, guys. See you guys next time.